Also, I, I notified uh, Chair Komeji the other day, uh, we were notified uh, by Subaru that uh, they discovered on April 6th an, uh, a leak of, again, ethylene glycol uh, within their facility. Uh, the leak occurs from a, occurred from a small piece of equipment or a piece of equipment that's used uh, to pressurize the mirrors when they're handling and moving the mirrors. This particular piece of equipment had not been uh, operational or turned on since July of last year. Uh, the cause appears to be a, a, a faulty O-ring uh, in the filter. Um, it's estimated uh, since the time uh, that it was last operated uh, that about six liters of fluid uh, were released in the building over an eight month period. Uh, there is no indication that this, uh, any of the spilled fluid uh, reached the uh, environment or the soil. Uh, it's all contained within the facility. Um, in an abundance of caution, uh, even though it did, it had the, the, the material did not reach the, the external environment, they did, uh, on our advice, notify the Department of Health and they are uh, preparing their written uh, report to the Department of Health as required uh, by Department of Health rules. Uh, so we're working closely with them uh, and monitoring that as well. 